On the Kasuth County Fairgrounds in Algona, there's only one guy with his own parking spot. And his name sewed right into the carpet. Because there's only one Arlen Ben Scooter. Yep, you're right. A farmer who always wanted a mountain. So we, we built a mountain. And his own kingdom surrounding it. There's a carnival down there. We got the lake up there on that end. A kingdom that's become one of the largest model railroads in the Midwest. It's Arlen's playground. Almost 80 years ago, his mom and dad bought him a set for Christmas. Every kid likes them. But Arlen loved it. I've bought a lot more since. <laughs> so much so? It kind of snowballed, yeah, you can say. The bachelor ran out of room. It got too big for me running the house, yeah. Because I've got, I figure I got over 400 engines. Lionel's were stuck on shelves until someone suggested an 800 square foot building for his locomotives to stretch, his factories to run, and his days to be filled. It's here whenever it's open. Because I'm basically the only one that can run it. Somebody asked us how many feet of track there are. I have no idea. It's bigger than most apartments with the power to thrill kids and frustrate their parents. Then they don't want to leave. <laughs> Neither does he. You've created a monster. Yeah. <laughs> in fact, this kid in his 80s has been known to be here 10 hours a day. When you get our age, it's time to go home somewhat time. So now, as father time chugs along, his passion is changed. Basically, it's somebody else in here that can run it. That would be a great thing. Make no mistake, Arlen's still buying more engines. Oh yeah, why quite quit now? <laughs> but he'd really like to invest in teaching another train nut how his whistles and switches work. Oh, I'd like somebody a little younger that would be really interested that's gonna stay around the community. Because Arlen's gift to Northern Iowa truly is an asset to Algona. And he'd love to have the confidence kids will find magic in a train whistle. Right here for decades to come. Even though he's been battling health problems, Arlen plans to have his train station at the Kazoos County Fairgrounds open every weekend from 1 to 4 until the end of the year. Eric Hansen, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.